Good evening, I'm Joe Arena. A Cheektowaga man was sent to prison for beating a gay man in Springville. News 4's Michelle McClintock was in court when Joshua Holtz learned his fate. I'm really not a bad person. Joshua Holtz addressed his victim's family before being hauled off to jail for four years. He's responsible for a bar beating in Springville two years ago. They left his victim, Scott Wright, looking like this. This is the surveillance video of the attack outside Casey's Bar on Main Street. Holtz was identified as the attacker, who didn't strike his victim once, but repeatedly. Wright's mother talked about that in court. After eight minutes, you felt the need to return to the victim and deliver some more blows to his already damaged head. This was a crime filled with hate that thankfully was all caught on camera. Holtz reportedly made anti-gay slurs, although Judge Thomas Franzek says this was not a hate crime, only one filled with anger, rage, and ignorance. Holtz apologized to Scott's family. I had too much to drink and just made some bad decisions based on that. And that you know, I am sorry for. Judge Franzek sentenced Holtz to four years behind bars and three years probation for that brutal attack. I'm just thankful Scott's alive. Scott Wright's mother, Judy, says she accepts the court's ruling and hopes her son's attacker gets the help he needs. It's sad when you see a young man handcuffed and taken away. Judy Wright says that her son has permanent damage to the left side of his face. He's already had four surgeries since the attack and has another one scheduled for next month. In the newsroom, Michelle McClintock, News 4.